So I got this handheld inkjet printer on Amazon. There's the brand. Handheld inkjet printer. Here's the instruction booklet for it. And I've already put the ink in because in the review I didn't really want to worry about dealing with all that. I've also already charged it. Here's the charging cable and it does have a battery so once it's charged you know just keep it charged and you don't need to worry about keeping it plugged in. And it's got a cool couple cool features one of which you can put images or different files on the little thumb drive. Hook the thumb drive in in the back here, same place you hook in the battery, battery and the thumb drive, and you could print whatever you've moved on to the little thumb drive. So I thought that was a cool feature. Another cool thing is it comes with a couple accessories, so it comes with this roller. So you just hook that up to the front and you'd be able to use it on some kind of little taller of surfaces. It does have its own little wheels on the front there. So that's nice to have for kind of higher surface. It's also got this which you just kind of line up where you want it. You put that on there, you drag it across so you know your working area is going to be right in there. It also, I mean you can also attach it. This also can be attached to production lines, so if you need to print something over and over, it also has that option. Which I believe, I haven't actually used this, and I don't know what it is, but this comes with it. And I'm guessing this is if you want to hook it up to a production line, because that kind of looks like a camera there. And it's got a little three pin that also hooks up back here in that green spot right there. I'm guessing that's per, for a production line so it knows when the next item is there to print on. Which would call for some different software but I've looked at the website and I've looked at the product and it sounds like you just contact them and they guide you through it. Um, let's see, what else? It's got a lot of different settings, it's got a lot of different fonts, it's got a lot of different uh, it's got a lot of different things on it. Green light shows it's working. There's the power button. And then the black button is to open the top to put the ink in. Now, let's take off this front part. Let's see if I can do it with one hand. Now the ink is exposed. And let's try to print something. Oh. First I have to tell it, confirm, and then I have to tell it, print. Now it's ready to print, put it where you want it, hold down the button, and drag it. Tells me I've printed, nah, my phone is blurry, there we go, tells me I've printed one copy. There it is, and I'd say that works pretty great. Let's try it again. So there you have it. I'm happy with it. It works really well, and hopefully the ink lasts, lasts for a long time. So far it's lasted as long as I've needed it, but I'm not using it on as high of a scale as it could be used on. So I printed that twice. It shows that I printed it twice. 
there it is. I've also printed on a couple other materials, but since I'm not doing that during the in, during the review, I'm not going to talk about it. But anyways, there's the review of this item. I'm happy with it. It does what it's supposed to, and it's really easy to use. So there you go. Have a good one.